Love is of Tour 2017. Absolutely insane. Best day of my entire life. My hand is like this on like every video because I am so nervous. Oh my god. I was going there to meet Shannon, but the stories from everybody else. Oh my god. Like so inspiring. Made you tear up on everything. It was amazing. My sister wasn't so nice to the camera because she really didn't want to be there. But even her on the car ride home, she was saying how crazy it was that she even left inspired. I'm telling you, it was absolutely amazing. So, really, if you have the chance to go, go. Because I've never seen anything like, like it. You go there and you feel accepted. And it's the most amazing feeling. You're there and all of a sudden I was making friends with people I never thought I'd be friends with. And the person next to you all of a sudden is just like, your friend it's insane you feel accepted and and i put together a couple videos there isn't a lot of videos of the show because i wanted to be there and in the moment on top of the fact that i was mostly crying during it because of how it, like, truthful and deep people were actually getting into their feelings but i really wish i kind of did record more of it but Honestly, it was absolutely amazing. So here are a couple clips. So we're shopping for Friday and she loses her wallet to find out it's in the stroller. Good job. Thank you. I look like I'm bald. Got the ponytail. No make I better really put makeup on to do these if I want to do this. Okay, it is Wednesday, so it's two days till Love is Love tour, and I'm freaking out because my phone case with Shannon didn't come yet, and she DM'd me back about it, and I'm freaking out, and I just love her, oh my god, and I got three presents going, I got a hat that says New York, I hope she likes it, and then I bought her shoes, I know it's a bit much. But I hope the message comes across. I'm going to write her a letter and everything. I hope it comes across. I've been packing my backpack. I'm so excited. I'm like, oh my god, I think I'm going to get sick. I'm so excited. I might pass out. My sister might have to catch me. I'm so excited. Two days. Okay, it's Thursday. So that means tomorrow is the Love is Love tour. And I'm so, 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 so nervous. But I'm so, so, so excited at the same time. And Shannon's mom actually liked my tweet today. She responded to me a couple weeks ago, but she liked my tweet again today. So it's making it so much more real. And my phone case actually came in on time to give to Shannon, which is one of my three gifts. And it's a camera. It's actually a phone case. So it looks really cool. But I'm not going to use it, but it's more like for show. I'm excited about it. I'm going to go write my letter, which is probably going to be like sad and emotional on my part. But I want to just get my message to her on how much she's helped people to walk on their own path. And how people can also follow other people's footsteps when they get lost too. And there's nothing wrong with that. And I think the store is helping a lot of people. And I didn't even get to go yet. So, so I'm really excited. And I know tomorrow is like really nerve wracking for me. I'm excited and I'm nervous and oh my god. And all these gifts that I bought for her. I hope the message gets across. And I hope it means something to her. As much as it means to me. So. Wow. Um, Is it the same person? <sighs> Finally I actually look like a person. And put makeup and my hair is actually done. Surprising. Because I've been in such a rush the past three days. And I really had a time to get done. But finally, my outfit to go. I am so excited. I'll have a still picture to put in. I'm so excited. I got about three and a half hours till the meet and greet. And I've never been so nervous in my entire life. And oh my god, I've never been so nervous. And I got my gifts in my backpack already. And now we're just waiting. Getting in the car. And Brooklyn, we've arrived. Come out and hang. 
This is what my dumbass just tweeted. I don't think I've ever been so nervous in my entire life. With my bag. What you got? <laughs> See how tonight goes. I'm gonna make an idiot out of myself. I know it. So as much as I said I was an idiot this about it. Ripped the papers and your face. She liked my And you want to get hitch back in my right she, like no. she, she liked my tweet. She you really liked my tweet. For Finally on the road, stopping to get gas. Excited as all hell. Des, how you feeling? Can you not film me? How are you feeling? I'm feeling hungry. I haven't eaten one thing all day today. Are you excited? Oh yeah. Nobody's feeling my hype. Yeah. Finally in Brooklyn, and they're arguing over the goddamn directions. No, we're not arguing about directions, we're arguing about time. Sure. Yeah, yeah, but it's gonna take us 40 minutes to get five miles. Oh, welcome to the um, so Is it like a mile a minute? Should I another one of my tweets? You could walk faster. Oh my god. Can you imagine we like just left? We yeah, sure walked. Stop. This is where our baby to Houdini's buried. I know. Houdini? Shannon, I'm coming for you. Yeah, but you still have one mile. She says she's going to a so country fast. Bird almost a shit on my gifts and your shoes. Wouldn't have been good. How do you give a gift to someone with bird shit? We just finished the meet and greet. I died. She remembered me. She doesn't really care. Oh my god. Show starts in now. Right, obviously those were all videos leading up to the meet and greet and then the last video was after the meet and greet and I was shocked I walked away crying I went up to the merch booth and the guy at the merch booth was kind of getting irritated at me because I was like this and he was like what do you want and I was like I don't know I don't know yet can you give me a minute I was absolutely in awe I went there to see Shannon and I walked up the steps and she goes Miranda and I was like, oh my god, she knows who I am. She knows who I am. And it was kind of stupid that I thought that she wouldn't know who I am, yet she likes like pictures of me on Twitter and she follows me. But it was like, I was shocked. And then she hugs me and goes, it's so nice to finally meet you. And I'm like, oh my god, like, finally meet me. Like, I don't even know who I am. It's nice to meet me. Oh my god. Like, so, like I was stuttering over every word. I was like, I'm going to make an idiot out of myself. And then she offered to open the gift in front of me, <clears throat> which I didn't want her to do because I probably would have cried. But also, if she would have opened the gift, I bought her the sneakers, which I think I got into in a couple of the videos, but I bought her a pair of Converse, which a lot of people wouldn't understand. And I wrote her the letter, and if she would have opened it, she would have been like, why did you buy me a pair of sneakers? But it was basically just that she left footprints for people to basically see and, and look ahead of you and know that it, people were able to keep going and that it gets better and I didn't want her to open it and be like why'd you buy me sneakers and she was so 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 sweet and then I asked to take a picture alone because I got to get the picture on Instagram when she said let's make these pictures a reality and we made it a reality thank you so much but I am not the weird stalker fangirl that everyone thinks. I'm really not. I was just really, really, really excited. And I wanted her to remember me after the tour. And I think I did. I think I got her to remember me with the gifts that I bought. And that's really all I wanted. 
So with my tweets, and I think a lot of people now know me after the tour because there were, I got like a hundred and something likes on my tweets. And her mom, hi, Queen Deb, you're awesome. Thank you for the picture. But a lot of people were liking my things. It was like insane. A lot of people now know me from the sneakers. But honestly, it was so worth all the money I spent. It was absolutely insane. So when I sat down, I was crying. And then right before the show, she posted the thing on Snapchat of the sneakers. Her old sneaker next to the brand new sneaker. I was freaking out. And I, that video was me like crying right after I met her. And then my sister's like... Oh. Okay, cool. Like, it was nice to meet them, but I'm just going to sit here. So, it was absolutely insane. Best day of my life. And then this is going to go into the pictures <clears throat> of me meeting them. So, best day of my life. Love is Love Tour 2017. Thank you for everything, guys. And maybe I'll post more videos on my YouTube channel. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I'm just so awkward. <laughs> That's the extent of my videos. <clears throat> my editing skills suck, I know, but I'm gonna get better at it and I'm gonna try and make a whole bunch of new videos and they're not gonna be all about <laughs> Shannon and Loves of Tour, I swear. This was just something that I was really, really passionate about, something I was really excited about for about a week before. I know everyone thinks that I'm like obsessed with it, I'm not. I was just really, really, really happy and really excited about this, but I have a whole bunch of videos from challenges I did, and maybe I'll post them, but I posted them before, and I got like 30 videos, so. We'll see. Thank you guys for everything, and thank you for all the people who were liking my tweets and messaging me about how amazing my gifts were, because that was really nice. People didn't have to do that. Thank you, everyone, Miles, and everyone for sharing their stories, Rebecca and liking my tattoos, thanks. Even though it's not even, my sleeve isn't done, but it means a lot. Thank you guys.